Hi fitness friends, today we have Athletic Cardio Pyramids, written by our dear fitness friend Amy S. So if you like this workout, let Amy know in the comment section. We did a workout similar to this before, um, so this follows the same format and the same type of workout in the Lift Like a Bro series. Amy absolutely loved it, so she wrote us another one. So thank you very much for that, my dear. All right, for this workout, I will be using my physio ball for one move, but you definitely don't need it. You could use sliders or just hop your feet in. Um, I will also be using my weights in my plyo box, and that is it. So I'll be taking some kids to preschool and getting Mikey for a nap, then doing a short warm up. So push pause, get yourself warmed up, and I will be back to the workout with you in just a minute. Say bye bye. <laughs> All right, everyone, I hope you are all warmed up and ready to go. We're gonna start right into this workout with some combo move pyramids. What that means is that we will do each part of the move full reps before we move to the second part of the move. For example, our first move is a rollback and pistol with a rocket lunge. So we'll do 10 rollbacks, then we're gonna do 10 alternating pistol squats, one equals one for that, and then we'll do 10 rocket lunges, okay? So we're working down from 10 to two, evens only. So let's just start with that. So 10 rollbacks, I'm gonna go this direction just because, why not? So all the way down, feet come up, roll it up to stand, that's one. Two. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. 10 alternating pistol squats. If you can't do a pistol, put your hand on a wall, on a bench, elevate your back heel. There's lots of tricks to try to learn how to do a pistol or just do like a staggered squat. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, rocket lunges. I'm going to do five per leg. So lunge back, rocket up one, two, three. Four, five, other side. One, two, three, four, five. All right, eight rollbacks. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, eight pistols, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight. Lunge back, rock it up, four per leg. One, two, three, four, switch. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay, roll back for six. One, two, three, four, 
three, four, five, six, six pistols. Make sure you balance. One, two, three, four, five, six, six rocket lunges. One, two, three, switch it, four, five, six, we're down to four, four rollbacks. One, two, three, four, four pistols. This was a really good body weight warm up move, by the way. One, two, three, four. Rock it up. One, two, one, two. Last ten. Two rollbacks. One, two. Two pistols. One, two. Two rocket lunges. One. Okay, first move done. Next we are doing discus throws and windmills. This move we are doing per side reps. So starting with starting with the 25, we'll see how it goes. So 10 discus throws with my right arm, then I'm gonna go into 10 windmills and then we'll switch sides, okay? A discus throw is exactly what it sounds like. You're throwing that weight up at an angle as if you were like a discus thrower in track. So meet your hand at the top. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Shoot that weight up. Pop your one leg out. Keep that hip and arm and shoulder in line for a windmill. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Switch it over. Ten on the other side. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Weight comes up. Other leg is out. One mil on the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we are dropping down eight reps. Let's keep going. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Pop it up. Eight windmills. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight. And 
and down. You got the other arm. Eight discus throws. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Pop it up. Eight windmills. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and down. Two sets, six discus throws. One, two, three, four, five, six, and windmill up. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Other side, four, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, and up. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Four reps and two reps. Here we go. Four discus. One, two, three, four. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Down, other arm. One, two, three, four. Up. One, two, three, four. Two reps, each move, each side, and we'll finish it off. One, Now, one, two, down, other side, one, two, up, two, one, and two. All right, nice work. Set that down. Our third move in these combo move pyramids is a standard push-up and kettlebell upright row. So, 10 staggered push-ups, 10 upright rows. I'm going with my 40 pound kettlebell. You certainly can use dumbbells for this. I'm gonna do five staggered push-ups on one side, then five on the other with my hand on the ball of the kettlebell, okay? So if you're using the weight, you just have your hand on your dumbbell. So five push-ups on one side, five on the other. Here we go. Squeeze tight, chest to the back. One, two, three, four, five. Up and over to the other side. One, two, three, four, five. Hop it up. Kettlebell upright row. Only your elbows are going out and your arms are moving. One, 10 reps. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Drop it down. You've got 
eight reps. So four staggered push-ups on either side, eight upright rows. One, two, three, four. Up and over, other side. One, two, three, four. Hop it up. Eight upright rows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, six reps. So three push ups on each side. One, two, three. Switch it. One, two, three. Up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Down to four. Two push ups on each side. One,
seven. Whoops, that was six. <laughs> I gave you one extra. Six box jumps. <sighs> one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Four reps. Let's finish it off. Four and two. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Four box jumps. One, two, three, four, and two. So, 
For this full pressure, I am just going to have my legs straight up and then put your arms straight up ahead and press up with the toe touch crunch. So here we go. 10 reps, slow pressure. One, elbows are steady. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Toe touch card for ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more skull crushers. I mean, eight more. Eight skull crushers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight toe touch crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Down to six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and two, one, two, I touch, one, two. <sighs> nice work. Okay. <laughs> Shake out your hands if you held the weights all the time like I did. We're moving on to a regular pyramid moves. We are going five reps to one rep for each move. Okay. We are doing these moves as a full move for one rep. So a star jump burpee, hang clean. So just a star jack at the bottom and a hang clean at the top. I will be playing with my easy bar for that. We have five reps to start. Then we're gonna go straight on to our second move. Our second move is a ball pike and tricep push up. So you pike up on your ball, go back to flat and do the push up as one rep. Yoga tricep push-ups, back to back with those triceps into dolphin. And then we're doing a kickboxing move, which is a right jab, left jab, sprawl, box jump, okay? All right, so box jump, ball, which is out there, and bar are all you're gonna need for this set. We're gonna move through it as quickly as we can. And I'm thinking that I will probably do five reps, four reps, three reps, and then repeat three reps, adding rounds two and round one together, okay? Thinking that, we will see how it goes. Let's start with these star jack burpees, do a hang clean. I'm gonna keep my hands on the bar for the push-up jack. Here we go. One. Jump to a pike and then tricep push up. Okay. 
okay? Five reps. Hands are close together, triceps. I mean, elbows stay in right by your rib cage. So, start first with that pike. Pike it up, come out, push up. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Okay, balls out of your way. And yoga tricep push up to dolphin. So the yoga tricep push up, head is down, butt is up. You switch positions, then press up into pike, elbows down for the dolphin. Here we go. Dolphin, one. boxing move, right jab, left jab, sprawl, box jump. So, facing your box, get in your squat. Two punches, drop down, jump up, jump up, okay? Sprawl, pop it up, box jump. That's one. Two.
two. Sure, I'll see you in just a minute. All right, guys, we have a very short six-minute hit set. 
set coming at you. So I hope you're back, you caught your breath, and you're ready to go. After this hit set, we have a finisher that's gonna be hard. But let's get this hit set done. 50 seconds on, 10 seconds rest. Three moves, two times through. I have my weights set up at either end of my mat, so go ahead and do that. I have 40 pound dumbbells for my snatches. You choose your weight. I always just give you what I'm using as a reference. Not at all suggesting that's the weight you should use. So, torpedo means a broad jump to that weight. You're gonna use a single arm and snatch it up overhead. Set it down, 180 squat jump and broad jump to the other side and do the same with the other arm on the other side, okay? Then we're doing a swimmer burpee, which is just a burpee with a front kick and back quick kick and 180 in the center, and then an angry donkey, and then a tricep fall push-up. I will show you exactly how to do that. These are 50 second intervals. You have plenty of time to get your reps in and to have a second round of it. So we have a 10 second countdown going on. I'm going to start with the broad jump. Here we go. So broad jump to the weight, snatch it up overhead, Set it down, 180, broad jump to the other side. Snatching with your other arm this time. Setting it down, 180. By the way, this was a millionaire coin move, but he didn't do snatches. He did the weighted 180 squat jump, I think. But he named it. Okay. Swim 
more burpees again. So front kick, back quick, kick. One eighty at the top. So push up first. Front kick, back kick, squat jump. Front kick, back kick, squat jump. Five. Set it 
down. And I'm just gonna grab a paper because I like to do hatch marks when I'm done with rounds. <laughs> when I work out on my own, I'm always using that paper. And that's, like, I think that's how I take my breaks. I'm like crossing out, circling, changing things. Okay, goblet thrust, five on one leg. So I'm gonna start with my right glute. Hold that like a goblet, sit it back. One, two, three, four, five. Set it down. That's one round. Let's go from the bottom up now. So switch legs. We're gonna do those thrusts again. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. All right, hand cleans for five. One. Let's add 
down together, okay? So starting back at the top, I'm gonna go with 30 pounds, and you've got 10 halos per side. This will make it go a little faster to adding two rounds together. Just my tactic. Here we go. You certainly can do the 10 rounds total if you want. Two, three, four, five, stay on the same side, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bring it down. Okay. Single arm swings. I'm not sure if I'll have to stop and shake out my grip or if I'll be able to finish it. Just going to do my best to do 20 total. Let's go. One. and then back up from the bottom and then back down from the top again. 
and then two rounds together again to finish it off, okay? So, starting off at the top, round six, 10 halo swings, five per side. Pop that weight up. Here we go, I'm back to 40 for this. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, setting it down. We have the 10 single arm swings. Alternating, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five hang cleans. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, single leg kneeling thrusts. Holding that weight up at your chest like a goblet. Let's go. Five. One, two, three, four, five. Now, that's round six. Going from the bottom back up, switch legs. Five more single leg kneeling thrusts. One, Two, three, four, five, and down. Five hand cleans. One, two, three. Alternating single arm swings. 10 reps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And five halos per side. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And down. Okay. That's round seven done. You only have three rounds to go. So, from the top down again. Halos, five per side. One, two, three, four, Five, other side. One, two, three, four, five. And swings. Ten. One, two, three. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And ten cleans for five. One. Okay, and the whole, <laughs> whole length of an hour and 10 minute workout, it really doesn't matter if you do five extra thrusts on the leg, I promise you. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, and down. Okay, that's round eight done. Now, nine and 10, I am adding together. Again, so I'm going with 30 pounds for the halos. Doing 10 per side. Gonna do my best to do the 20 alternating single arm swings, drop setting the hang cleans, and then all I have left is the thrust. Okay, wipe the sweat out of my eyes, and let's finish this off. Here we go, 10 per side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other side. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bring it down. Drop that off. Done with those. We got the 20 swings. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Okay. We've got five hand cleans. For me, it's at each weight. So ten hand cleans total. Let's go. Last round of heavy hand cleans in this workout. And my glutes are sore, so. I'll be glad to be done with the, both of these moves. <sighs> you guys are like, when don't we have sore glutes? <laughs> we always work them. Here we go. <sighs> One. Four. 
four, three, two, one. All right, kneeling thrust, five on each leg, and you're finished. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Switch it over. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, nice work, guys. Oh, my goodness, Amy. You kicked my butt. It <laughs> feels awesome. Guys, please let Amy know what you liked about this workout. I just, all the parts were oh so challenging. I feel really athletic with not a lot of whole lot of heavy weight use, but I'm extremely worked. <laughs> so please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. If you sweated along with me, let me know. And I love you all so much. I will see you at the next workout.